Happy Monday, YouTube family. Happy Monday to you. It's in the afternoon now. I hope you and your family are doing okay. I hope everything is good. I am giving thanks. Never have that drive there for today. Me the kind I like. You know the Monday blues, but me fight it. I'm rather late, but me fight it. So me end up ain't going to do anything else but cook dinner. I'm going to be cooking some dinner. So I want you to stick around, cook with me. So, I will tell you what I'll be cooking in the next clip. Hope you are keeping the faith. Hope you are keeping your sanity up. Not panicking, not going about, you getting crazy. As we keep saying, this thing will pass. It's a bit hot here in Jamaica though. Really hot. When I tell you the sun is blazing on the outside. I know I'm here on funny sound from my AC last night. So I call my um, electrician. He said probably I know nothing much because it's relatively new. So turn it on just like no. I mean I really hear nothing yet. But I just said whoops and nothing not wait. Because look here. We really can't take no more all house here right now. So stick and stay with me. We're going to cook dinner. I want to get you in the cooking mood these few days coming up. We're going to cook together. We're going to do things together. And all of that. Catch you in the next clip. So, YouTube family, you got any coke? I'm supposed to have some frozen coconut in that. Mm -hmm. Supposed to have some coconut in the freezer when I could have take out and blend, don't? Uh, yeah, I think so, you know. I'm using this today. I never remember that, but another day. So I'm just cooking a small pot of rice and peas. I wash these already, though. You know? Remember these? If you can't wash them, you must wash them. Having everything done, you must wash them. So, should have showed you that I had some frozen peas. Peas. You know, sometimes when you cook peas and you cook, me always cook more, and then left a container it frozen. It might extra cook though. Sipping again today, a little red wine. It's nothing harsh, not anything too, just a little, you know. You know, sometimes a little red wine is good for you. So I'm just sipping today. It's not anything with any a lot of alcohol, just something mild. I see go along, but I'm not sure if I like the taste of that one. <laughs> you know, the other one the other day was sweet. This one says sweet too. But, I don't know what they call sweet. As, not sweet as in a lot of sugar. But that one you have a... So may I go dissolve um, Coconut powder. Some warm water. Yes, as I was saying, family. I always cook more than the amount of peas I want. And leave back some. Sometimes you feel like you want the rice and peas. And guess what? The time is not there to go soak that peas. So you must always cook peas and keep it ahead. Maybe I'll show you some other little prep video there. I really don't cook like a lot and store a lot of food in freezers. Like, for, you know big cooking and leave it for two three weeks when I really cook like that I really don't enjoy that food I prep I prep but I don't do a lot of cooking and re-eating I like my food fresh most of the time mind you, you know sometimes you know you do a little thing but like how some people all two three days them just cook with you know well me can't say with the people in a big family as me, me tell you to get yourself in the frame of mind to come into the kitchen every day to cook for our family of, of eight and ten that's a lot that's a lot it's gonna take a whole lot out of you whether you stay at home and if you work that worse so I think we could have caught the people then but like for me would I just stray away because I don't really like responsible for Jerry just like if my cook and him feel like what I want, you know. So I just like for me, dad and camera girl. But sometimes certain things Jerry, you know, so I don't need to do a lot of cooking and I never do it like that. I always cook fresh. 
But as I said, for the people with a big family, yeah, but I do prep. Somebody left me a comment <clears throat> on the Jamaican cooking journey. They, uh, was it? They said, they peeled yellow yam and was going to freeze it and it turned black. That can be done. And I think when things change coming, I'm going to mark it, you know. I'll show you some things like the sheen and cocoa yellow yam. I did it already. I've done it a few times well. And you put it in the freezer. If your freezer fire good, fire good or your deep freeze, you peel it, you bag it and put it. When you're ready, you just take it out. You don't even have to thaw it. You just put it in the pot or in your soup. I mostly use them for soup when I freeze them. Some of the yellow yam come out nice. Some of them come out, depending on the nature of the yellow yam. They said it came out black. But I'm saying to that person, I did reply to them though, if they're on the Jamaican cooking journey and watching this video, I think the problem would be that the yam wasn't to perfection. A young yam or too much fertilizer. I think it has happened to me already. You know, so I, I prep sometimes like with veggies, carrots, string beans, kalalu. I'm gonna show you a little a dose to make life a little easier. <clears throat> and all of that. So yes, I'm mixing my milk. I had frozen peas and it is there on the stove being thawed out. I season up with a lot of milk herbs. I'm gonna know for milk dry herbs then. I'm gonna have not much as like skeleton and thyme. I have dry thyme. I don't have fresh and then two local crunch as skeleton and that is for the rice and peas. That's what I have for now. I'm gonna put some extra garlic and some scotch bonnet in the chicken i'm gonna do fried chicken i'm gonna do fried chicken because i want to fry some chicken and make a good amount of gravy i want to leave back some of my chicken fried chicken gravy for a video on the jamaican cooking journey i hope you will follow me there if you are not yet subscribed if you are here and you are not yet subscribed to my cooking channel I leave the link in the description you go check it out you may see this video before that video probably may maybe maybe not I'm not sure but anywho you take it you'll be seeing these two videos I'll be frying some chicken making some fried chicken gravy and let me tell you something I am a victim of making small amount of gravy how about you I am even from I was doing the catering I am a victim <clears throat> of making small amount of gravy <laughs> so I'm gonna try to make enough and then to leave back some I've got a video for you on the cooking channel so I'm gonna put in my coconut milk just now you know um, let me see if we can show now I'm going over here so of course I can yep of course I can Small amount of rice and peas. See my peas? Yeah. So, put in this now. I am listening if me hear the extra sound from the AC. <coughs> my electrician say, I don't have to pay it much, man. But family, let me tell you something. When the whole house then go for come down, pine you. Then enough, you see. You get up one day, you don't plan for do nothing but before you know it. You end up a fear fix broken AC and see. But he said that I am not to worry because this, this is fairly new. And they don't go bad, like, you know what I'm saying? But if I hear this song again, I feel call him, so. I'm hoping I never hear that sound again. I'm going to go finish seasoning up my chicken. Still thinking about the vegetable. So look here. I want you to stick with me. If you've got something to sip, sip. Right? If you haven't anything to sip, sip a little water. You know, remember I told you, I am not, what I'm doing is not any harsh alcohol. Just a little, you know, them little ladies wine. So just, yeah. You know, some people we just want it soft, but 
what am I going to do? I can't stop people from talking. You know, super little ladies when I always have, <clears throat> not always, sometimes I don't have those little Eva wines or some of them little light. Some of them are just like less than 5% alcohol. Some of them are made for ladies. So as I go, that's how I do it. Super little sometimes when I'm in the kitchen. That's how I do it. And it keeps you more, it makes you be more relaxed. Make you feel, you know, in times like these when someone's sitting, you just take a little sip. You don't, if you're a person that can manage alcohol well, you can do to your liking. I am not a person who can manage alcohol, so I could never be drinking. If you're sipping, cheers. Yeah, relax yourself. Mm. Could I could even have some sauce up to night. I sip to. Well, you know what about that? Well, family, the kidneys are frying. Got me right here, a steam down. I really want to look more peas. I underestimated the container because I don't have enough peas tonight. But look here. Fried chicken, chicken is fine with you, family. Mm hmm. Right, some peas you have to say done. Yep. Never have a lot of peas this time. I don't know why I made the pumpkin and never have a lot. Yeah. And cabbage and carrot. Never um, make a little vegetable. I think I have some. This is the carrot that I have. I may have half of a cucumber and I have half of a cabbage. I think I might not use all of that cabbage. I'm going to take me have some nice burgers and never put it with it. Yep. I have one problem, family. You know my eyes are. I have one problem. And let me show you all what I'm sitting today. Some days I have nothing. This is what I'm sitting today. It's just cool to say, um, like, you know, Jamaicans, we not do full wine with the meal, but like foreigners, but maybe some Jamaicans are doing it now because everything changed. But I got one problem. I just showed you what I have, I'm going to use for vegetable. I bought, I had the, 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 the Cucumber was whole, the cabbage was whole, the carrot was whole. They were whole. I bought them whole. And I, they, because the carrot was big, I used a piece. I used half of a cucumber, half of a cabbage. Why would I not show that this is what I have left to make the vegetable? Why should I not show you? Why should I not show you? It's only when I have the whole one I show you. What do you think about that? I have a problem with them kind of something there. Though. That is why me have to be different because me are showing on that me I use. You know? I wouldn't hide that. Because I never saw me buy them. I never buy half a cucumber, half a cabbage. Well, maybe in the supermarket you would get half of a cabbage, but not at the farmer's market. Nobody would cut it. Cut it. No matter how big the cabbage is, they would never cut it. Them now sell cut cucumber, they cut carrot either. So, why not show it? What do you know about that? Tell me something about, about that. And if you're just joining me, cheers. We're cooking dinner. And all of that, we're doing fried chicken, rice and peas, Jamaican fried chicken, maybe picking out just the dried flour. And all those three videos, they are in depth on the cooking channel. I'm going to leave the link for you and you go check it out. Okay? So... That's where I'm at. Gonna get my vegetables made. My vegetable milk. I think I have a piece of iceberg lettuce. I'm gonna check it out. I don't remember when we were doing the cleaning out of the refrigerator the other day. I don't remember if that, if it was there or it wasn't there. I'm gonna go search. I think so. Probably it was me. But it not really matter. So I'm gonna get my vegetable now done. And what I want to come back to show you is most of all. The fried chicken gravy that I'm gonna be making because I want you to follow me onto the Jamaican cooking journey and see 
the left above chicken gravy what I'm gonna use it to do so when you see me next everything should be ready and we'll be making the fried chicken gravy okay so this is my first set of fried chicken my first set of fried chicken pretty ain't it so pretty so I have my, this is not even shredded this is like a chopped cabbage I won't bother to use the lettuce because this is enough so I leave it for another day the iceberg because it's almost the same color as the cabbage and I'm making I use up everything one time car I guess I'm gonna have no fresh veggies so I shred now I hope you're seeing yep face cutter so I'm doing my cabbage now I have my cucumber chop there so you yeah, see that you must sit down sometimes when you work hard and yeah cook you must put a little seat like this so I'm gonna get me a nice episode I have one of those eye chairs but it's a bit high so I'm just most time sometimes I'm not bother with it but it's like when I do the cupboard but most of the time I do it here, so I'm sure my cabbage here. I'm going to incorporate it. My carrot is what I'm doing here. Put it now into my cabbage. And this is on the Jamaican cooking journey too. This is a well-loved little Jamaican vegetable. Easy. Most time you go rest the regular restaurant, never that you make. You get done. Most people do it at home. Regular little Jamaican vegetable, but it goes well when you put a little vinaigrette on it. I showed it to you. I have the, the, the video up in case you're new here, or if you are not new and you have not seen it, I'm also gonna leave the link for you. You see the contrast, the whole color thing inside the bowl here now, because the carrots are bright and pretty in color to make my table clean so I can take up my tomato. So you see, so we are going to toss it, and when you see me next, I will have my chicken all fried, and rice and peas ready already. This salad will be put together, and we are going to be making that chicken gravy. I want to show you, I've done it already, but I want to show you on this channel again. Because when we go to the cooking journey, you won't be seeing how I make the gravy there. Okay, we are just going to use that gravy to do something get you in the next clip. all right now family i the chicken finished frying and look what i have in there i did this video already hold on i did this video for you fried chicken and showing you how i use the sediments from the fried chicken to make the gravy so i'm gonna leave the link for you to go in the description i'm gonna leave the link to that video in the description of this video so you can go and look in depth because this one won't, will not be in depth. So I'm going to leave these, look up, this piece of um, scotch bonnet in there with a little garlic that I used to flavor the oil before I started frying the chicken. And I'm going to leave it on high to come to a boil. Whilst I'm leaving it on, to come started frying. Alright, so make it go and fry. Alright, fried chicken gravy ready. Yeah. And this is the thickness of it. So, the direct fullness of how I made it. I'm going to leave the link. I fried chicken. On that video, I fried the chicken and I used to make the gravy. So, in depth, in depth, if you want to see that, I'm going to leave the link. I fried chicken and I made the gravy. Now, I'm making this gravy because I need some extra, some of this gravy to do a video on the cooking channel for you. So, make sure you go to watch that video. But I think you might see this video before. I'm not sure which one you'll see first. So you make as much as you want. This gravy is through. This fried chicken gravy is true. I will return. And I will be... When I return, I have some American dinner. Just for you. This, this is a Jamaican dinner. Rice and peas, fried chicken. That little um, raw veg. And your gravy over your chicken. Masuk. Okay, now family. Dinner is served. This time I've given... I have dished up breast and wing. Who liked breast and wing the last time I did? Breast and, no, leg and thigh. Who so desire breast and wing? Please take up your plate. This is for you. Let me give you some of your, of this fried chicken gravy. I don't know I'm putting it. 
over your chicken. Not giving you too much because I don't like all the gravy. This is for you. Dinner is served. This is a typical, a special. We, this, this is cooked in every, almost every single house in Jamaica. Maybe once, if it's even once per week. Most times on a Sunday and sometimes in the week. This is served at our restaurants on a daily basis. Fried chicken, rice and peas, raw vegetable. If you have liked my little cooking video today, oh, and all of that, some little bit of wine, like a bit of wine left. Cheers once more. If you have liked what I cooked today, remember to leave me a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you stay subscribed. Make sure you're checking out all my channels. When you do go there, make sure you're subscribed, as I said before. Oh, if you're not subscribed, please do it. Hit the notification bell. Press the option all. Oh, thanks for the love. Remember my little merch. Go well, give me a little support. Stay blessed. Stay sanitized. Stay sterilized. Stay love. Keep the family together as we fight this virus. See you in my next video or vlog. Ciao.